Well, this mod pack has an interesting uh, situation over here. I walked in here. I've been in this room many, many, many times. Many times. There wasn't an elevator here. There is one now. Now, why is there an elevator is an interesting question. This work, there's like a 5% chance of these things working, by the way. Something like that. Something ridiculous. Alright, so this elevator. I know this elevator hasn't been here before. Now, going up this elevator, I was, um, I like to explore. I like to hoard. Also, I'll just pick up anything. Hoard things. Okay, just chill. Whoever said it thought that had a bad thought there. Now, this is an interesting thing. Okay, number one, the graphics is great. I mean, look at the, look at the concrete. I mean, don't look at it too close. Well, I mean, it's not too bad too close either, but it looks so good. Uh, all the textures look so good. Yes, I'm having screen tearing still. Oh, look, flickering. Oh, I love flickering. Not. Anyway. This part is the interesting part. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime girl. Send me a kiss by wire. Baby, my heart's on fire. If you refuse me, honey, you'll lose me, then you'll be all alone. So baby, telephone and tell me I'm your own. I'm not sure what to do. I pretty much got to this point and went, I'm so glad you make it. Huh. I know it says trap on the ground, but it's actually short for interview. Now, I should introduce myself. My name is Captain. My friends call me Captain. I know what you're thinking. I'm stuck in a room with limited air supply. Where do I get water? Where do I go to the bathroom? Well, don't think such negative thoughts. Because in this cutthroat economy, I'm offering you a job. And after careful consideration of all the other qualified candidates in the interview room, I decided to pick you. Now I hope you'll join me in a delicious post-hiring celebratory brunch. Try to lie. Oh boy. So, I have to drink the thingy. Well, I'm gonna make sure... Okay, look, there's blow torches all over the place. I'm, I'm like, somebody robbed the bank at some point. <laughs> oh, look at this. Not Nothing in none of these safes. I mean, like, literally nothing. Ah, oh, come on. It's gotta be something, right? I mean, give me some scrap, at least. No, you want me to drink and stuff. Ugh. It's a trap. It's a trap. It literally, literally says trap. Oh no, I'm over encumbered. Uh, all right, fine. I'll, I'll stick some cheap stuff in here. Oh man, this is. Uh, hello, my darling. Hello, my baby. Oh man, it just reminds me of uh, Cartoon Networks. Not Cartoon Network. <coughs> Bugs Bunny. Had a frog, a dancing frog. The only time this frog will actually dance is when nobody else is watching. But always dance in front of this guy or someone, and they would try to tell somebody, and that would end up him in a straitjacket. <laughs> wow, this song doesn't stop. I didn't never hear this song before. All right, I'm unloading. I should have unloaded with one of my followers before I walked up in here. The value of the weight is too high to ignore. Yep. Yeah, I'm dropping that off too. Mm. Ro what? How long is this song? Or how long is it good this? Oh, anyway. I don't know how much is this. I'm going to be copyrighted. Alright, I'll just, uh... 
<laughs> I, do, I don't know how much this is, this is going to be copyrighted. What am I supposed to drink again? I don't even remember. No, 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 no. Anyway. All right. Oh. Definitely not drug <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, you're not actually catching that part. It is actually literally saying definitely not drugged wine. Okay. Um, so definitely drugged. So we're uh, going for a trip. Yep. Let's see what happens when they drink the wine that's definitely not drugged. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh. Oh, look, a welcome mat with an arrow. I am, this is going to be copyrighted like crazy because all I can remember is, oh no, I forgot. What was it? Wow. Seriously? There's a house in that reflection. Oh man, this is gonna be copyrighted like crazy. Head to the stern. Um. Why is that here? Alright. Oh, there's an arrow on the ground. Look for the arrows. Obviously, this person wants you to. <sighs> oh, my health is down pretty low. Oh, man. I'm going to have to hit some. I uh... didn't realize my health was that low. Hello, my darling. Hello, my baby. Oh my god, I don't know what I got my character in into. I don't think it's good. I mean, it's it's obviously a trap. That just can't be good. Uh, how does this run? I mean, how is this supposed to run? Like... Is it a fuel burning or something? Okay. Okay. Oh, there's an arrow. Uh, I think in this is probably more traps. But I don't need to try to grab some stuff along here. So, oh wow. Oh, can't sleep in any of them. And nothing in there. Did not want you getting rich on this quest, did they? All right. Um, I like soap. Soap. All right. I can hear the recycling of the uh, sound effect of the ship. The sound effect is just recycling over and over again. Definitely not a drug is up there, and uh, didn't even notice that. It's counting down. Oh, great. That's. Oh, yes. Let's just go straight to the door. Okay. Uh, let me take some right away while I'm here. So, we're going through this door, right? 
Oh, great. That's empty. Radiation just... Radix! We gotta have some Radix! Do I have any Radix? Yeah, that's right there. Don't know which way to go. Up or down? Or this way? Alright. This can't be. This just can't be good. We're on an adventure! Is that a key? Accessible. Okay, that's a little that's a little creepy. Kinda got me there for a second there. I was like, uh uh, okay. Ooh, a lock I can actually make. My character can actually do because she's literally beginning. I don't feel, found Nick Valentine yet. I mean, seriously? And I'm in a situation like this. Oh, this is not a good situation. I can't sing. Sorry. That was just bad of me to try. Okay, wait a second here. Oh, downstairs maybe? Radioactive and now it's radioactive, so let's try upstairs. I really wouldn't go in there. Okay. I jumped, <laughs> by the way. Um, wow, I really wouldn't go in there. Okay. That actually made me jump. I, 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 this that's interesting and it makes me very much more nervous that this thing is actually interactive in that way um, that means there's a setup wow man what is going going to happen to my poor character All right so I really wouldn't go in there Novice? I'm not. I'm not novice in hacking. That doesn't make any sense. I'm guessing somebody didn't like the blue and uh, yellow or blue and gold screwdrivers. They made them red, which kind of makes some sense because if you're actually looking for a screwdriver, it's easier to find a red screwdriver than a blue one. Oh man. I got drop stuff. I need to get that. Nope. Not what I meant to do.
Medic's just going off. I can hear the rads increasing. Why are you standing there? Move. I should have dropped stuff off. Oh, I need the leather. Oh, so annoying. 10, 25, 5. What was 5? Oh, man. That's only 5? How is that only 5? Uh, I need the leather. Uh, well, I guess we'll have to go without leather this time. Need to put that back on to power armor. Oh, good lord, I missed all those. That's an accessible. Accessible. Interesting. An accessible. The question is which way do I go? Second, I get distracted by every little freaking yellow box and everything else, all sort of thing that's in it. All right, so not that way yet. I don't think that's inaccessible. So, oh wait, what just happened? That's not good. Okay, not so bad. All right. All right well. Maybe not so bad. It kind of reminds me of uh, Rivet City. I mean, kind of similar. I mean, the interiors remind me of the steps and all that. Welcome kind of... to employee training! Oh, God. As you can see, there are four doors in front of you. Four, two, three, and H. Behind each of these doors is a rocket launcher that blows up you if you go for the wrong door. Three of the doors are dangerous and one is safe. Which one is the safe one? Well, that's where employee training comes in. You see, I believe that it's an important part of the boss-employee relationship is that you, the employee, need to learn how to follow orders. And that means listening to me. So just sit patiently for the next 30 seconds and I will tell you which door is safe? Starting now. Okay, I am not. This is going to be totally copyrighted. Oh. Alright. I think it's this one. You know, if you had just waited, I would have told you the correct door. Opening more doors until you find the correct one doesn't mean you chose the correct one. Okay, those are actually damaging. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I am impatient, evidently. All right. This door was also incorrect. Oh, wow. This was the right door, but you just don't listen, do you? All right, how many mi how many missile launchers do you have on this thing? All right, let's see how much these things are worth. All right, let's see here. <laughs> All right, so this is the he didn't like that very much. Uh, <laughs> it's like 
just because he opened all the doors doesn't mean he chose the correct one. <laughs> it's a good point, but still, I mean, I'm kind of impatient. So you gotta, oops, no, no, just kind of drop a couple of these. Oh, missile launchers are heavy. Let's see, how much are they? Um, uh, poof. I'm using that. Uh, let's see. I get rid of this too. Uh, that's ten. Oh man, that's a forty-five. That one's actually does pretty okay. Damn, I'm doing seriously. Do I have to get rid of that? That's ten, thirteen, six, six. We'll go ahead and get rid of six. Um, still over capacity. I just, I'm a hoarder. I like to have the things. You get, you put it in front of me, I have to pick it up. All right. So this is 20 minutes, 20 minutes long. I'm going to have, go ahead and upload it because it's, my phone only uploads it like 30 minutes. So I'm going to have to figure out what happens.